Hey guys, I'm Adventure Andy. I'm playing The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3DS for the Nintendo 3DS, and this game is brought to you by GameOneOne.com. Uh, yeah, see, there it is. Uh, just sorry to spoil that in case you haven't figured it out yet. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna watch this for a little bit. Alright, I'm done. Man, my childhood is giving me the biggest direction right now. Because I totally have such a memory with this game. See, there is my link file from back when I was a week ago and bought this game. Oh, God, I was so young. Uh, Alright, new game. Uh, let's see. If I can hope, I hope I can remember my name. Sometimes I have trouble, but normally I, I make it through, so we're gonna. Andy! Fuck! See, I'm it's not Amph, it's Andy. Alright. Or okay, rather. Is this name okay? I mean, yeah, it's the one I was born with. It's, so, yeah. I'd say it's okay. Actually, I was born with the name Andrew. My friends call me Andy. Yeah, start. File 2. Let's go. Childhood commence. Gets nostalgia, that's why. In the vast deep forest of Hyrule. Long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree, and I am not going to voice act. I'm just going to read the shit so you don't have to. Is that a sink? The children of... <laughs> I don't know why the, ch the sink surprised me so much. I guess I'm not reading this. I'm just going to make comments on the room. No, oh, that's, that's interesting mirror, too. I like how, ten years later, on the 3DS, Link still doesn't realize to put on a blanket. <laughs> you dumb fuck. You wouldn't be shivering if you had a blanket. Those chains are so 3D. <laughs> I like how it, this is like a 3D console. The chains are still like paper and like two dimensional and kind of dumb looking. Yeah, ha ha ha. He has a weird thing on his forehead. He just wants to give me a high five or show me how big his hand is. Maybe I just imagine him being like, "Hey, little boy, did you know if your hand's bigger than your face, you got cancer?" Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. I thought that's Hitler for a second. Jeez. Ooh, look at that handlebar mustache. Damn. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words. The words of the Deku Tree. He's a lot better at growing a mustache than some people I know in real life. And his lower lip is also kind of sexy. Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. Yeah, it's kind of cold in here. I didn't really turn up the heat in my house before I started recording. Malevolent forces. Malevolent, I mean. <laughs> Obviously, it's English. Even now are mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri Forest, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. Yeah, that's what it's for. And it's doing a great job in, in the real world, too, because obviously we have one of those at Kokiri Forest. But before this tremendous evil, even my power is as nothing. Well, I mean, you're a tree. What can you really do? It seems that time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Why would they leave it to a kid? Like, that just doesn't seem like a good idea at all. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I mean, puberty is such a confusing time. I mean, fly, Navi, fly, blah, yeah, obviously. I mean, puberty is such a confusing time. I mean, it's already tasking enough to, like, figure out why the hell there's, like, hair growing out of my testicles. I wouldn't want to, like, be like, oh, yeah, you should, uh, like, probably save everyone. Oh, he's doing a little Irish jig. That's cool. Shut up. And so this is a first person view of the Nintendo 3DS. At least he's not humping the rock anymore. He's still trying to get it out of the ground, but his dick obviously isn't touching it. Or isn't so seemingly touching it. Whoa. This 3D is so cool. Only I have like astigmatism or something and I can't see 3D, so I actually can't appreciate this game completely. That mirror is really interesting. I'm fascinated by that mirror. What exactly is behind me? Hello. Hello, Andy, wake up. The great Deku tree, in white text, which means it's important, I think, wants to talk to you, Andy. Get up. <laughs> I would want to get up if I was cold. I would want to get up and find a blanket. Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? I don't know. I mean, you've seen how this goes on the N64. I'm assuming that that is probable. You moan like a bitch. And <laughs> your skirt clips through the bed. You finally woke up. I'm Navi the Fairy. That's an interesting name. Uh, the great Deku Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. Thanks. You're pretty alright, I guess. I mean, it's kind of weird, though. Like, this is an awkward 
time to meet someone when you're just waking up in the morning. Uh, the Great Decker Tree has summoned you, so let's get going right now. And then I just realized Link doesn't shower for this entire game. That's kind of gross. Like, never ever does he shower. So I haven't even played this game yet. This is another blind run of a 3DS game. But I'm going to play the N64 version, so how different can it be, right? Kokiri Forest. Pick up the pace. I don't have all day. Actually, I do have all day, really, because I mean, there's no time. To Yahoo! I prefer Gmail. Hi, Andy. <laughs> Get it? Gmail. <laughs> Ooh, his ladder climbing skills have increased. Wow, a fairy! That's my face that you're looking at, actually. But, you know, whatever. Finally, a fairy came to you, Andy. Wow, that's great news. I'm so happy for you. Now you're a true Kokiri, Andy. Or Kokri, I don't know, I don't really care. Is that right? The Kokri kind of sounds like a beverage. Uh, the Great Decker Tree has summoned you. It's quite an honor to talk to the Great Decker Tree. It's a fucking tree. How great of an honor can it be? I'll wait for you here. Get going. Go see the Great Decker Tree. Alright, you wait right here and don't go anywhere. And I promise it won't be a waste of time at all. <laughs> this is such a weird looking... What? what? I'm trying to tell if he's, like, dancing his feet to the beat or not. Hey, you, Mr. No Fairy. That's not my name. What's your business with the Great Deku Tree? Without a fairy, you're not even a real man. <laughs> I'll bet that's never been said before by anyone else in, like, history. What, you've got a fairy? Say what? The Great Deku Tree actually summoned you? What? Why would he summon you and not the Great Mido? And because your name is in red text, and that means you're a bad person. I don't believe it. You aren't even fully equipped yet. How do you think you're going to help the Great Dagger Tree without a sword and shield ready? Well, I feel like a sword would make him scared, because I could stab him. I mean, he literally can't move at all. He is stationary. That's actually probably a really depressing existence. If you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a sword and a shield. You should at least put every major um, noun in a different color of text. If I do it, will you stop dancing? I'll, I'll probably do it anyway. Shut up. I don't like you. Hi, Andy, look this way! Look over here with the L and talk to me with A. Hey. Yes, yes, that's he's the fairy. It's it's a thing. Um, I get it. It's really great. L targeting. It's like Z targeting, but for the Nintendo 3DS. Mm -hmm. du, 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 du. Secrets that I've known about forever. I love the music in there. I hate to leave just because I wanted to keep listening to the music. Du, 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 du. And then if you jump over here, you get a. A blue one. I probably should have done that first. Is that another blue rupee I see over here? I think it is. Hey, it is. You need 40 blue rupees. So, yeah, there's rupees in here too. In case you've never played Ocarina of Time before or never seen one of the millions of Let's Plays on the internet of it. But I'm glad that I can do this game. Yay, a blue rupee. Because it's kind of like a different game, but it's still the same experience. Who would keep a green rupee in a chest? What a waste of space. A heart, yay! Hearts are fun. Although, that'd be kind of grotesque. And if I found a heart and a chest, I'd probably be a little disturbed. Especially if he was still beating. But I doubt that's possible. I would talk to so many people if I cared. There's so many things I would do for the world if I cared. It's such a sad thought. I'm really kind of an asshole. Link looks like such a goofball. He looks so awkward in this game. Should I talk to her? Well, it did come up here and steal what I'm assuming is her rupee. Did I fall? He, you came all the way up here. You're a real man. <laughs> oh, silly. You, you don't even understand. Real men have to have fairies. Look, isn't that very pretty? Change your viewpoint with so you can look around the forest. Okay. So, it's kind of like I was looking up her skirt just there. But I guess a real man has sexual thoughts. So, that's normal, I suppose. Whoop. Bridge jumping. Because when old people talk about playing bridge, that's what they mean. Old people are the most agile of creatures, as we all know. I hear rocks. Well, I have 40 rupees. That's cool. Hey, a sign. I love signs. Although I don't like reading them. I just like admiring the fact that they're signs. Uh, silly rock. You're not going to hit me if I'm chasing you. Look, a random chest. I wonder who put this here. Oh man, I wonder what this is. I have an educated guess, but I don't want to look like a fool. 
Oh, okay. It's a good thing I didn't make my guess. I thought it was going to be a butter knife. Alright, let's go. Oh, I got to equip it first. Using the bottom screen. Uno momento, por favor. That's Spanish for uh, just a sec, I think. Equip. Yes. Is it equipped? It's equipped. Let's fight evil. One piece of bread at a time. Because this is kind of like a knife. And put it back in the thing. Might have such a tool, but now we get to cut him in half. I'm so excited. I can't wait to see a tree. Man, trees are so rare. I love trees. If you want to pass through here, you should at least equip a fuck you, I'll cut you. Let's go right now, come on. Jeez, Mida was invincible. Maybe he should be the hero of time. I honestly feel like we'd be safer in the hands of him. Link kind of squeals like a bitch a lot. You can't even see over the counter, you goober. Alright, uh, shop around. I'll buy this shield. Yeah, sure. You got the oh, wow! It's so special. All right. Uh, no, nothing else for me. Good evening. No, leave me alone. I don't feel welcome. I actually feel like I have to leave now. <laughs> I'm drowning, and now I'm not. That must be such an inconvenience. Like his balls must get so chafed. He's always like walking around with like wet clothes on. All right, time to equip my gear. Like Link like goes in water and gets all wet and then walks around. Like that would chafe the shit out of my thighs and my balls and everything. You want to see the great decor tree? You should at least equip a sword and a shield. Oh, what's that? That's my nipple actually. But uh, yeah. Oh, you have a deco shield. Yeah, I do. And what's that? Is that a Kokiri sword? Yeah, I found it in the forest. Good grief, Charlie Brown. Well, even with all that stuff, a wimp is still a wimp, huh? Ah, the great Mido will never accept you as one of us. Well, that's kind of like segregation. That's too bad. I should like pull a Rosa Parks and like. Still going anyway. Shoot, how did you get to the favorite of Saria and the Great Decker Tree? Huh, Grumble Grumble. Alright, cool. Let's Rosa Parks this bitch. Whoa. I love dancing. Oh boy, a stick! Man, I love sticks. They're so rare, too. It's not every day you just find a stick lying on the ground. Great Decker Tree, I'm back! Oh god, that mustache. Oh, Naffy, thou hast returned. Andy, welcome. Listen carefully to what I, the Great Decker Tree, am about to tell thee. Thy slumber, these past moons, must have been restless and full of nightmares. As the servants of the evil gain strength, the vile climate pervades the land and causes nightmares to those sensitive to it. I don't know what that means, but uh, yeah, it sounds like a bad thing. Verily thou hast felt it. Andy, that time has come to test thy courage. I have been cr cursed. I need to break the curse by thy wisdom and courage. Dost thou have courage enough to undertake this task? Uh, well, hmm, this game's E-rated, right? So, if it was T-rated, then I would already feel great, so... But, but I don't know, that joke was stupid. Uh, I'll go in, yeah. Oh, jeez. You just buried your chin into the ground. That would hurt. Then enter, Andy. Navi, the fairy, thou must aid Andy. And Andy, when Navi speaks, use to listen to a word. I, I normally I pronounce buttons, but I don't know how to pronounce that button. So, yeah, I'm just gonna ignore it. Alright, well, anyway. Uh... Okay, what do you want? Uh, oh, I can tap it here on the screen. Come on, be brave! Let's go into the Great Deku Tree! I'm glad they didn't remove the Hey Listen thing, because that, that would have been missed. A lot. Anyway, for now, I'm going to mention Andy, and I will see you guys next time when we go into that tree. Goodbye.